I am Dr. Purudhaman and today I am going to talk about something that has created a lot of confusion among kidney patients and that is kidney regeneration. I will try to clear some common myths and facts related to kidney regeneration and further. We will also discuss the reality of kidney health and healing. So to begin the video, first let's talk about regeneration. What does this term means actually? Regeneration is a process by which certain organs in the body can repair themselves after being damaged. For example, the liver has a special ability to regenerate itself even after the removal of some of the its part. However, this concept does not apply to all organs. There is a myth that kidney can regenerate themselves just like the liver. But this is not true. Yes, you heard it right. Kidney lacks the ability to regenerate themselves. In simple words, when any part of the kidney is damaged, it cannot regenerate to or grow back. This means that once the kidney cells die, they are gone permanently. And it is important to understand this because it shows why taking care of your kidney and properly managing kidney related condition is so crucial. The wrong information that the kidney can regenerate can mislead the patients and prevent them from focusing on better effective way to manage their kidney health. So if the kidneys cannot be regenerated, then what should be the approach for a kidney patient to manage the disease? Instead of focusing on regeneration, the patient should concentrate on the healing the remaining part of the kidney. Now let me explain this concept in detail. When you observe the cell of a diseased kidney properly, you can find there are two types of cells. The first type of the cells are which are dead and they have lost their functionality. And the other type which are inflamed but are still alive and non-working. The dead cell of the kidney can't be made alive again but the inflamed cell can be made healthy again. If the patient understand this thing, they can make their diseased kidney healthy again just like before. And this process of making the inflamed cells healthy again is called the healing of the kidneys. So you can say that the kidney cannot be regenerated but still they can be supported and their function can be improved through various measures. Trust me, this approach is more realistic and beneficial for the kidney patients. Now moving further, let's discuss some of the important steps that helps effectively in increasing the kidney working efficiency. First, focus on your keeping your blood glucose and blood pressure level in the normal range. You must note here that hypertension and diabetes are the leading cause of the kidney damage. Whenever blood pressure or glucose level become too high, they put a lot of stress on the kidneys and as a result, the kidneys start losing their functioning ability slowing and gradually. Second, indulge in the herbal medication that are free of any side effects. Herbs like Gokru and Varuna can really help in the healing the diseased kidneys. Along with this, regular exercise is also important. Last and most important, follow a healthy diet. A healthy diet is very important to heal the inflamed cells. This diet should include foods that are low in sodium, potassium and phosphorus. Such a diet helps reduce the burden on the kidney and prevent further damage. Always remember that a proper diet is very important in the journey of kidney disease management. Usually kidney patients start skipping meals as they get bored of eating the same tasteless food daily. As a result, they start developing body weakness. To avoid this, the patient should approach a good dietitian for a diet containing different foods in their daily meals which are tasty and kidney friendly too. A strong patient can combat kidney disease effectively but once the patient starts developing body weakness then it's become very difficult to withstand the kidney treatment eventually the condition become fatal or life taking for the person so i hope you have understood well about the three ways that can help in the healing the kidney effectively concluding this video here remember while kidney cannot regenerate, they can still function effectively with the right care and attention. If you have any doubt, please ask in the comment section below. See you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye and Namaste.